And this is what I really like about data assets is this ability to have to have functions on. Hey Ryan, I'm making an upgrade system like Vampire Survivors. Is there a way to execute code based on a data asset? For example, increase speed or health or add a new attack? Oh uh, yeah, you can do. So if you're doing a data asset, you'll have something like this. Okay, so we do primary data asset. And this is one of the nice things about data assets is that ability. So I'm going to DA upgrades here, get variables. And we'll say this is going to add a speed variable. On it. it will have loads of others on it, but we'll just do speed one. For now. This is what I really like about data assets is this ability to have, to have functions on them. You know, you can't write to them, okay, but you can do stuff with them, okay? So I can take speed in here, take the character, get the uh, character movement component, get the max walk speed that we currently got, do whatever mumbo jumbo algorithm I want to do do add <laughs> and then spit it back out okay. and that's why i like data is because you can do functions like that for more game dev tips and advice subscribe and follow ryan Lely games